for? Oh, heart so cold. They think I sold my soul. <laughs> like I would ever sell, sell my, my soul. soul. No, they wanna know how I'm so cold, cold with it. it. My niggas see me and say, bro, did it. Bro, did it. My diamonds dance, I'm got them so living. So living. If you were ahead of my young. I might have fucked a couple big bitches, but I never fuck with jealousy. Niggas talking like a op, keep the same energy. Homie said we crew still, but Brody just a friend of me. I don't fuck with you still, you know I got a memory. I never changed like Hov said, you can't relate If you never slept on a cold bed You wasn't plucking roaches off a of mold bread With holes in your pro cats I was only a team but felt more like a old hag Fuck cancer. Mm-hmm. Fuck cancer. Mm-hmm. Rest in peace, Georgie. Mm-hmm. Rest, Rest in, in peace, Clark. Rest in peace, J Hatch. Rest in peace, J Hatch. Fuck cancer. Fuck cancer. Mm-hmm. Fuck cancer. Cure something. Ah. Now speaking of cancers, you know, so, shit that, that 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 involuntarily just be fucking up your life. Little dirt recently. <laughs> I don't know how you. Mm. <laughs> I'm gonna tie it in. I thought he said Dirk. I thought he said Dirk was a cancer. Yeah. I thought he was gonna say it. Trying to be I want to call Dirk a cancer. No, no, not a cancer. His his zodiac sign. I yeah, thought you would do something like that. that. I'm but still trying to. <laughs> the snitching. This is the this is the the era of the snitches. Mm. It's like, you know, and it, it, there's a lot of speculation on who. Was the actual snitch? But he, for according to to the dockets, he has what five, four co-defendants. Yeah, yeah. right. Um, the names and details are not listed, but everyone's speculating that someone wore a wire. Well, it's all over the internet, so it's not like y'all hearing it here first. OTF Jam, mm-hmm. yep. one of his homies that did twelve years. Mm-hmm. He came home and he was running with the crew. People are saying he was wearing a wire for two years. Over two years. For over two years. Mm-hmm. Why are they saying that? Does anyone know? I saw a tweet. That's all I saw. You saw a so tweet. Where did, did it start? I saw a tweet the that came out. The earliest thing the that I've seen, because I looked at the indictment, and I don't know, maybe I need to give it another nah, thorough. It's not- I was reading it for the third time. There, there's nothing in the indictment that says it says video surveillance. Someone wore a wire. Like it says video surveillance. It says witness testimony, but it doesn't say anything about unless that's code for wearing a wire. But does, it doesn't directly say. It says yeah, surveillance footage, but right it doesn't say informant. Yeah, electronic informant. informant wire Not in the indictment, so I don't yeah. know. Like it could have been one of his homies. It, it could have been one of his homies that put that that um shit out on him. Because a lot of the news articles are saying that it's it's in the court paperwork, and this I haven't seen it in the court paperwork. It's not in the indictment. Maybe right. there's something. Maybe else there's that, something else that we yeah. didn't see. Mm-hmm. Maybe but, they've extended the maybe they've extended the indictment, added on to it. It's not in the indictment. Well, we well, just okay. got to be cognizant that what happens during these situations, people, the feds, sometimes themselves would throw some stuff out yeah, there they, they, right. to, to just create the disunity exactly. to make it seem like people telling on each other. Yep. Right. So I'm really going not. by what they say in the indictment. I don't see it clearly in the indictment. The video sub- surveillance they talking about is these cars that committed that crime, following them from location to location to location. Buying them. Airplane tickets. Buying the airplane tickets. Right. Yeah. Looking the hotel rooms. Right. Now right. supposedly, <laughs> good, yo, uh, uh, Good people are hard to find these days. Supposedly there was a text sent out specifically saying, do not book any of your fucking flights with anything that's under my name. And of course- That's in the indictment too. Someone still booked the hotels and flights under one of their business names. And used a business card to buy ski masks. 
<laughs> Yo, you can't make this shit up, man. Yeah, this is crazy. You can't make this shit up. So how about so is, 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 <sighs> it, is it more of the snitching or just people not knowing how to move? Oh, both. we don't both. we don't know. There's a lot of both. Even at Texas, incriminating. Yeah. Telling yeah. somebody don't use my my yeah, joint, none that, of that. Like everything. that's that's not they incriminating. gonna look at that. That's right. not incriminating. But it, it, it is if they trying to tie it in. What, they, what they're saying is they think that you that can number, imply mm-hmm. something. Yeah. Right. They think that number is is one of Dirk's phones, but they don't know. Mm-hmm. So it could be incriminating, but then you don't know where it actually came from. And so, you don't know the you don't. Unless there's more to the text than they've shown, you don't know the full context. Right. He could be saying, listen, I'm not paying for anything you motherfuckers are doing. Don't use my card to book nothing that you're doing. Right. The, I've told the, people the card that is myself. cut off. Yeah. Don't, don't use my card. Yeah. That could have been the case. I've told people that myself. I mean, even when you look in the indictment, one-way tickets, why one-way ticket? Don't leave until the job is done. Mm. You know? Why not? All of this is implication. This is this is what the feds are going to try and prove and, and connect it. But all of this, you, you're, you're implying that this is what I meant when I sent that text, and it may not be that. It, you know, if, no, but I'm saying why the one way, why the one way? Because I'm not paying for you niggas to come back. Maybe I'm pissed at you. Maybe you did something <laughs> yeah. before you left. Maybe I have a problem with the way you blowing well, through well, money. What they're saying, could be anything. What they're saying is they drove down to San Fran and flew out from there. Okay. So, round trip wouldn't make sense in that. Situation, okay. yeah, it could. It, what I'm saying is, if I'm if I'm his attorney, it still sounds like he said, she said, unless they have more behind it. So if if somebody actually did wear why, that would, I mean, it's overkill. Push it over the top. People get in, yeah, people get indicted without a why. They just need one of those people to say. Well, he's already in, he's already in trouble. This whole thing fucking sucks. Like, can y'all stop shooting each other? How about we get to that part? All right, all right. Mac, we've been over this, yeah. man. Right. We've been over this. It ain't never going to stop. It ain't never going to stop. The thing stop. is that how can you tell somebody to stop once they family member got killed? Exactly. And that's the never because ending killing somebody cycle. else ain't going to bring them back. Listen, man. Yeah. This is why I watch, feel like I watch not anime. Nothing is just as bad. In anime. Yeah. So some people feel like not doing nothing is just as bad. It's not just as bad. It's not. It's not. Because eventually, eventually, it's got to stop. All right. For my anime heads, I... I for everyone who watches Naruto, there's a, a scenario where um, his master and his village gets attacked by this character named Pain, right? So Naruto defeats Pain, but instead of killing him, he lets him live because he didn't want the cycle of revenge to come back around. Mm-hmm. That's why I fuck with anime, man. They be having some real <laughs> wise shit in there. You know what I mean? They might be talking animals and shit, but they be having some real wise shit in there. Now, out here, I think the biggest issue is you're, you're someone who, you sing about street life. Uh, you, you place a lot of importance on being connected to the hood, connected to the homies. Mm-hmm. One of your homies gets knocked off. Now, Everything that you were saying in these rap songs, people in the comments, yo, you ain't slide for, for long, no. It could be a fed. Like, that, that's what we were talking about. It, it might be the feds in the you, comments, you like, yo. You pussy, nigga. Like, you ain't doing pussy, nothing about that. <laughs> watch you. slide on yo, that. Yo, watch you. Sure. Watch, watch you. you go do it. And they know for really do it. It really be a fed doing that. The feds do it. As much as they act like they don't, they know for a fact that these artists and public figures do read those comments. Yeah. And, or it they does, got a team. and it does affect them. And it, yeah, it definitely does. I, I remember being in situations where either I was the nigga who did the assaulting or I was assaulted. Those comments would never let those issues die. Right, right. Yeah. What was the point? <laughs> you got to break it down. We gotta, we, we gotta see, break it down. Look, you got to lose the button. No, I don't want to lose the button already. Okay, what's You said the, you were the one allegedly doing the assaulting. That's not a post. Oh, that's not a, that's somebody not a, take a button. Wah, wah. A, take the button. <laughs> <laughs> take the right, You got one more strike. Okay, I got one more strike. <laughs> <laughs> I really want to take the music. I just really want to. She brought it. <laughs> yeah, so, so you know, what, what, whatever issues I had that became public or whatever was done publicly, I could piece it up with these niggas 150 million times. All they got to do is wake it up, wake up in the morning and somebody say, you pussy, math, da, 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 da. And then they hate me again. That's mm-hmm. part of the problem. 
you're letting your life be dictated to by people who would never say that shit to your face. Yeah, I mean, it's shallow-minded shit. You're getting your buttons pushed by somebody in their mom's basement. Facts. You know, on, a, on a filthy couch. Facts. You letting that dude dictate your, your million dollar brand, your million dollar life. These motherfuckers who are talking this shit have nothing to lose. They've never played with house money. They've never played with yours. Right. They've ne- they don't know what it is to deal with somebody else's facts, figures, stresses. You wonder why I don't read the comments? Who are you listening to? Who? Mm. Who's your teacher? Yeah, you don't know. You can't <laughs> you, you can't peek into the profile and be like, oh, this nigga's a bum. Don't fuck him up. And, and, and you'd be you'd be <laughs> pissed. You'd be pissed off if you found out you made a move based on the thoughts, ways, actions, and opinions of this nigga. Don't you know, if you actually bum. saw what he's like what his life looked like. What right. was so crazy? As soon as they slide. And something happens. Oh, you was foolish for doing that. Then the whole, the whole. That's the other side. Yeah, yeah, there's no. Uh, there, yeah, there's no real, real shit. None of these people are gonna be behind you in the courtroom when you get caught for sliding. Mm-hmm. Know that the comment section is not pulling up when you need an appeal. <laughs> they're not putting money on your family's books. They're not putting money on yours. They're not. They're not. Wow, no commissary. Nothing. Right. Nothing. Nothing. All the people who was gassing you to slide will be. Ghost. They probably they'll not even turn, following you. They, they'll turn the routers off. They'll they'll unfollow you. It's over. Right. And all that shit. You you let these niggas gas you to go do some horrendous shit that you can't take back because of the words of the comment section. I knew I'm, the stupid nigga was gonna not, crash I, out. I, I'm not saying. I'm not right, saying right. That, that, that. I'm, I'm saying it plays a part, right? I'm not. Uh, that no, might not. That, I agree with you. It may not have been the key motivation. And yes, man, it is, it is, it's fucked up. But it, they got me a couple times too, bro. I woke up. Oh yeah. <laughs> well, I catch this snake. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yo, y'all want to keep making jokes? Ain't gonna be funny when that nigga dead, huh? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That shit rouses you up. It rouses you up. You gotta, you gotta consider the source. But I, and, and I, and I have, and I realize if I go near, I can't go near certain individuals. Because I know what I'm jeopardizing, right. and it's not worth it. Let's talk. Let's talk frankly. Let's talk frankly. You had advice from Claude Kent. Claude Kent told you what to do. How dare you listen to anybody else? How dare you? Tell him again, Matt. You One had <laughs> Clark fucking Kent. Don't get me emotional in here, yeah, man. Because, because maybe, Come maybe, on. maybe, maybe you should. Come maybe on. you should. We nah, talk about man. somebody who affected the culture at every level, from the elite god tier to up and coming, to never been heard from before in life. And this nigga, this nigga had his hands in all facets. Everybody in their mother got a picture with Clark Kent because he showed up everywhere mm, for fact. everybody. Mm, fact. The elite tier. Jay Z, Nas, Biggie, the nigga was up there doing it with the best we've ever had, ever, ever, and still showed up on a podcast, not ours, not ours, but still <laughs> showed up on podcasts with people you've never seen before. Right. Mm. That was Clark. Mm. He gave you advice, and he was a gatekeeper, but he closed the gate on whack motherfuckers. Yeah. He closed the gate. Definitely. He didn't keep that gate open for everybody. <laughs> you couldn't be whack and walk through that fucking gate. He closed the door on a lot of people in his face. That man gave you advice. You have the nerve, the nerve no, to listen, take advice from about the, the fucking same. comment section. No, that's not what I'm saying. Or to let anybody saying. in there tell you anything. It, but it, I know it, I'm I, saying to you, Mac, it's not, it's not just the comment section. You think, you, you think Dirk, you think the comment section was the only motivation? It's no, not just that. No, I think he was affected by the comment section in real life. I think niggas in the comment section was actually in his fucking entourage. I mm. think niggas from the comment section was mm. in his ears. The same mm. energy, whether they in your face or not. It's the exact same energy. He does speak about it in his music. But you got, you got to understand, when you come from a certain background, you claim this person is your brother. Mm-hmm. Someone takes your brother from you. It's like, it's like we all know what what we weren't supposed to do in hindsight. But in that moment, while those emotions are like stirring, when you when you when you pick up the phone in the morning and you go to call a person, you realize no one's gonna answer on the other line because they're gone. Or you, you're having dreams and you you know what I'm saying? Like that shit I believe is the main motivation for why anything okay. allegedly happened in the situation. Okay. That that that's Awful, and I get it, and I hear you. 
even more of a reason to knock this shit off. Mm. Even more of a reason to knock this shit off. We go, what you doing? What you doing? How's this going in? This is all you want? Maybe. On the block, spinning <laughs> ob shit. Children raised without fathers, without mothers. That's People easy to say, though. It just right depends on the situation. What do you somebody want? Somebody violate what your you, mother? Bro, bro. My mother's, somebody my mother's your daughter, not God in, forbid, my mother's like, not in places shit for is. shit to this, that. Like, you, you got it. You, we, the, everybody has to stop. It's not just me. It can't just be me by myself. No, I'm just saying. In general, yeah, no, it's I, I, easy I don't, don't want to Begat, I don't want to hear that shit no more. And we've been hearing that same song for the last 20, 30 years. Everybody involved in street shit always tells you the exact same thing. Everybody got the same story. How the shit's going in. We know how it's going. Everybody, but, but what the fuck? We act like we don't. Oh, Everybody yo, acts Mac, like they didn't. No, we don't act like we Mac, don't. Yo, Mac, you 100% right. Dirk actually I'm got records is, talking about this whole shit playing out. Like, yeah, yeah, but what, what I'm saying what, is, what are we doing? It depends on the situation. If you got a kid, you know what I'm saying? Your kid was molested. Niggas ain't hearing that. Like, if somebody raped your mother, God forbid, like, you not... You gonna just gotta end? Gat, I'm killing gat, you, gat, nigga. Gat, gat, gat. I'm killing you. Nine times out of ten. Certain shit I go to jail for. Nine, nine point five times out of ten. We not talking about nobody's mother getting raped or somebody's daughter getting molested. True. We talking about dudes getting shot on the block. And the worst part, it, the 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 only small little street part of my brain is screaming at me. It's not even over money. Mm. You ain't even doing jealousy. it over money. It's be jealousy, envy, I'm like, yeah, I remember. I remember the gangsters when I was growing up. Nothing happened if it wasn't over money. Niggas would put the guns down because it would slow the money up. We can't do this shit here, mm. nigga. The cops gonna blow the spot up for the whole night. It's gonna be... It's, Everything whole, shut for down. For a whole month. They, 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 gonna, be right, they right, gonna be spinning right, the block right, looking right. for everybody. Where's the money gonna come from? Right. You niggas is fucking up the money. like, And that's True. the small part of the street part of my brain. Where's... It's not even over money. True. When I was a kid, anytime we heard about anything happening, it was over bread. Right. You could trace it back. <clears throat> somebody ran off with something. Somebody ain't paid something. Right. Somebody or caught female, somebody else. Female, female, female. Yeah. female. Niggas dying like a, at an old time e high over Even bitches. then, you was a sucker for that. When right. it was all said, it's tender dick ass niggas just went right, there, right, got right. locked up over there, and she out here fucking everybody and their mother as soon True as she get locked right, up. Right. Nobody, nobody respected that shit. You, you sounded crazy. You sounded crazy. Facts. And when it was over money, it made sense. Nobody got at you because you got at this dude. Yo, he, this motherfucker cost me like 10, 20, 20 racks. Oh shit, well we gotta- Make a bust to sell on my you block. You can't even get that shit back. Now, now, now speaking of money, um, FBG Duck, Duck what's his name? G, Duck. FB, D, Duck. FBG, FBG Duck. Duck. His family is trying to hold the record companies involved for financing the hit on, on him. Mm. So, so I mean, that's very important because when we look at this Bless culture, you. Thank you. Thank you. when we look at this culture, these companies know what they what they're funding. They know the gang culture. They know everything. Mm -hmm. And they funding it and giving them money to commit these acts. Because what? No, it sells can't, records. You can't say that. It sells records. They give this the man have like two keys to two cities. It, it, it's not the image. They don't walk into the record label and be like, yeah, that, one it's, more week. That nigga about to be out of here. We're going to we gonna drop this record right at. They're not doing that. They're not doing it. Can we know the, what he's actually charged for? Because conspiracy... To what was it? Murder, murder, murder for hire. To inter, yeah. Like, and there's interstate, like, and for murder for hire. Yeah, it's a little different than just some street shit. Yeah, it really is. Mm -hmm. It's premeditated That's murder conspiracy. for hire conspiracy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's, it's, it's a right. little different. Right. It's, it's street a, shit with money, and he's going to get more time yeah, than shoot the shooters. Shoot money. <laughs> yeah. it's street shit with money. Is it? <laughs> He's gonna get back. Yeah, you can't, be it having it no, you can't be having no murder plot with a bunch of people involved, and I ain't even talking about dirt. I'm just talking about in general. You can't be you, especially if you an entertainer and a public guy. You sell millions, you do millions of streams, you on everything, bro. You know them people watching you with a magnifying glass. Right. You feel me? So if you involving five or six people into some conspiracy, you going to jail, bro. If 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 one dude ain't ain't wear a wire and tell, somebody else gonna tell when y'all get snatched up right. and the feds start talking death penalties and hundreds, hundred years and all of that, somebody gonna tell, bro. So if you involving seven different people in a plot to shoot and kill, it's only a matter of time before you go into the penitentiary. What's crazy to me is 
none of these young dudes be having no older dudes around them. Like, I don't even be seeing these dudes around right. no older no OG geez. niggas that's right. going to be like, yo, bro, I done did 20 years. Don't do that dumb shit. They're going to come for you. You, you feel know what, what I'm saying? You know what, though? That clip mm -hmm. resurfaced of Wallow saying something yeah. to him. Yeah, that, that was interesting, where he was actually telling him, like... He was crying in that yeah. episode. Yeah. Wallow, Wallow, Wallow broke down. Shout out to Wallow. Shout, yeah, out, shout to Wallow. out to Wallow. Shout out to Gilly. For actually trying. Um, Wallow broke down, and he was talking about how he had to forgive or let go the, 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 the guy that, that killed his brother. Mm -hmm. And he said that once he did that, then his life started to change mm -hmm. because you can't, you can't carry that. Right. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And he begged and pleaded with Dirk and said, yo, you know, in a way, let it go. Go check that episode out. Yeah, too. go check that uh, episode Wallow, out. Wallow, Gilly, and um, Little Dirk. Shout out to Wallow for, 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 for dishing out the real for all these years. Like he's really been on his mm -hmm. job as to far as message. like- Yeah, a lot of stuff yeah. from yeah. experience. That's Facts. why, you know what I mean? You, you gotta just gotta get people, back to what you were saying, we have a we have an issue, and this is how deep ageism goes. Because you start talking about they don't have any OGs around, but when the youth are being told to stay away from irrelevant, you old, you wash, they, ah, yeah, ah, they ah, don't ah, even ah. want no OGs around. They so how dissing. you gonna, how you yes. gonna tell them? But like, the OGs fall in line because they go they gravitate to the dudes who got the money. Well, it, 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 it depends. On, it depends on which ones we talking about and what their motivations are. I know personally, there are dudes forty up which is an OG now, 50 and up, definitely OG status, who, who are not out here trying to get next to money. They're genuinely... Master P got all the money he need. He He's quick to try and, hey, listen, let me see that contract. Let me, let me talk yeah, to you about... Yeah, this is all after everyone already got. You got to understand, these young dudes, are, the whole objective is to make money. These young dudes, is they, they figured it out. I don't got to listen to the OG now. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You so you want to keep it. Right. So How you become an OG. And then, That's and the then, part that right. they really Right, because that, in, in the, what's that saying? In the world would a good die young, fear the old man? You you mm. sit there with, you You want to keep it. You right. made it. Sure, you made it. Right. You made it. You want right. to keep it? Right. I never heard that saying before. Right. That's kind of fire, though. Take it with you. Yeah. You want to yeah. keep it? Right. Because <laughs> like this dude can show you how to keep it. He, this dude can show you how to, he been around a long time, playboy. He's not out here because he didn't show up for second place. Mm -hmm. He can tell you how to keep it. Mm -hmm. But you you so flash in the pan, you think what you got now, you're going to have forever. And then you'll be the same nigga two, three years from now, crying on the internet about exactly. how you got jerked and how this one jerked you and that one got you. Now, majority of these kids are crashing out. And you're you going to crash out and we all going to see it. <laughs> and then... It, why ain't you listening to nobody? Right. Nobody was around to tell me. I, 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 I. There's plenty of people around who could have told you. A lot of people who are career artists. Shout out to Buster Rhymes. He's been in the business for 30 plus years. Every chance he get Every, with a young dude, he a tell fan. him it's a story for like, like an hour. Mm -hmm. On some shit, don't do this. Do this. Don't, I'm telling you. I'm just trying to tell you. Listen, don't, don't do this. Don't do this. Don't, that, and people start, you see them start to glaze over. They start getting tired of hearing. Mm -hmm. They just want to turn up. Mm -hmm. Hey, 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 listen to me. I'm trying to tell you. Right. You see it coming. Got to listen to the OGs that have been <sighs> in the game for a long period of time and or, got longevity. You talking about listening to the OGs. Who? We're talking about generations of people who watch Scarface and... Fucking Carlito's way and forgot the whole fucking ending. <laughs> <laughs> forgot the whole ending, son. Like, yo, this nigga got hit with a shotgun. Uh, it's like, yo, you do this, you're gonna get hit uh -huh. on a balcony with, with a shotgun in the back. Pow! And you're gonna die in a fucking pool, nigga. Everybody forgets that part. And they're like, yo, you know what? <laughs> I think I'm gonna be the special one. And they find out. Feds be like, ha, ah, he wasn't so special. Mm -hmm. Not so special. You don't even get to die in a blaze of glory. You're just going to rot in the cell. Yeah, it's sad. Even in sports, a lot of teams that win championships have veterans on their team. A lot of teams have talent. Yeah, win. right. When you when you see right. like the old dude that don't That's get that much playing example. time get, tra get, get, get yeah. traded to yeah. another team, he's usually the guy sitting on the bench whispering at everybody's right. mm -hmm. ear. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. it, it's sad. Now let's talk conspiracy theory. A lot of people are saying someone in his team wore wire for two years. 
Mm-hmm. What's the name of that movie? Donnie Brasco. <laughs> mm-hmm. He had a Donnie Brasco in his circle. Who? Who? Did, what's the name of the guy that they seen did that? Jams. OTF Jams. OTF Jams. He had all the videos. And he got blessed crazy when he came home. Yeah, apparently there's a there's a lyric. Um, Jam got out that jam. Uh, I gave him fifty. He ain't got to ask no more. Right. And then they, there was footage. I looked this up mm-hmm. um, of him talking about yeah when I came home, dirt to care of me and all that. But and this you know this this, all crazy. this shit. This part of the show is a legend. This right. none of this shit is based on actual fact. The evidence that we've seen. We're just going off of. All the whispers that, that that's going around. Well, all the whispers and also all the reported articles that have taken the whispers or taken the tweets and put it in their coverage and said it. So it's in a lot of yes. articles. I don't I, I just can't trace it back. Well, I say if he didn't do it, he sure is quiet. Mm. Where's his Instagram, his social media? First thing I would say is that that's untrue. I, apparently he was one of the guys that slid. Okay. He, he Does that even help though? Having a social media? Yeah, I mean uh, I if mean somebody he's doing at least one thing right. If somebody you know what I'm saying? I mean, yeah, but if you a shooter and you ain't got no Instagram. Something. Yeah, that's yeah, that's what I'm talking about, right? You never had an Instagram? I don't know. I've never seen one. No, because Bro. you could delete your Instagram and they could still get your account. How do you, how do you delete it before, like Oh, it's the feds? <laughs> Delete, delete, delete. Probably yeah. was deleted before even niggas even did it. Instagram. Yo, deleting your gram is the equivalent of flushing the, flushing the work now. <laughs> <laughs> delete the gram, delete the gram. They, they at the door. If you can flush the whole five, they can't get it back. Instagram, you can delete your gram. Yeah, they have to But they have to know it exists. That's the only thing. Well, I'm, even if he shut his gram down to, what I'm saying is, if if you shut your gram, then you shut down all your social media. You tell people you didn't do it. If, when you when you tell people you didn't do it, they go, oh look look how mad he getting. He definitely did it. He sound guilty to me. Nah, and, then, man. and then you shut down and you don't say nothing. Why he ain't saying nothing? See, he quiet. He if, guilty he as guilty. fuck. You don't need social media to get a message out there. He could have sent it to anybody he know popular. Say yo, that's untrue. What I heard. Why yeah. we ain't hear nothing from him? No, no but but, but, but we're hearing a lot of personal stories. Like uh, one, I, I want to say this: I watched the video where he was talking about um, good man, fifty, you no, know, like right, water. <laughs> <laughs> well, now you gotta say, when we press these pause buttons, we gotta yo, make, yo, we gotta yo. break down what was a pause. Yo, is it going to We not gonna play that. that. We gonna, you gotta break down. Why Kim was like now? Now. <laughs> Who was the pause, Kim? Who pressed it, Kim or Matt? I didn't press it. That was Matt, Matt, Matt her. She pushed my hand down. No, oh, that was Matt Kim. It. It, it appeared no, that, that he was choking on something. <laughs> she was like, oh, now. <laughs> he was choking. Where's the pause button? Uh, it was so crazy. Kim wanted to press it so bad, but she said, no, so, she, she, she was, was, like, she was shaking. Like, she was like this. I want to press that shit so bad. Yeah, she was she said, nah, I want to get my pause button taken away. <laughs> so I watched this video of this guy, and I, you know, I don't know. It, maybe it's it, it, my discernment just just said something, something not right. Mm. So you yeah. felt you felt that he I I felt that there was there was something there that wasn't comfortable mm. with singing this man's praises. Mm. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. He felt it wasn't genuine. Yeah, it wasn't, you know, he didn't really want to talk about the mm. shit. You know what I mean? Yeah. I don't know. And then, you know, being a being an artist, being at a certain level, trying not to be disconnected, you may overlook some things. People, one of the theories that's being tossed around is that something happened to Jam's baby mother and nobody slid. Yeah. Oh, RP to her. Out. Right. RP to her. She, I heard she was a postal worker out there in Chicago. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And she got caught up in the mess and mm-hmm. nobody went to ride for her. So I guess he felt betrayed. Mm-hmm. Or, Allegedly. 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 Yeah. Or mm-hmm. here's another theory. That could have been, 
I don't know about the two two year wire thing. That's crazy to think about, right? Yeah. Ah, gotta, gotta go to work. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's wild. I don't even. Will. That's crazy. That's wild. It's not that complicated. Put your phone on the table. Record. They got voice. You ain't gotta wear. Your phone. Yeah, I'm just talking about why he's up. doing from like he's looking oh, out for them. They hanging. They traveling. They doing all. He couldn't just, be like, yo, give him the. Like right, like. <laughs> Yeah. Yo, do y'all remember when he caught that case in Atlanta with Kevin Holland and he did bail out and he did go on the news and say he was innocent and everybody was saying he should have never did that because now he's implicating that. If, if he's innocent, then Bond's still locked up. And Bond was guilty, so people was getting at him for that too for speaking out mm -hmm. too fast in that case. So mm -hmm. maybe that's why he's not hearing nothing. Part of the evidence is saying that he was Bond and Bond were friends. Part of the evidence is saying him and Bond were friends. I. When it was on Hot 97, I mean, was it Hot 97 or 105? When Vaughn was about to say something, and, and Dirk was like, <coughs> hmm. remember that? Mm -hmm. That shit was crazy. So you you guys think he's done, or? I don't want to say he's done, you know what I mean? I'm, we're not, we, we're we, not going to say that. We think he's in trouble. OK. Yeah. We think he's in trouble based on the situation and the because police ain't come get him, the the, um, the alphabet boys came and, and got him, so it's yeah. totally Fucked different. up that right. he's in trouble due to these, this situation and these circumstances. Do you guys yeah. think that he made it worse by trying to flee after We don't know died. if he tried now, to now, We don't that's know. A, a we don't know if he tried Because the same person that booked the flights for the shooters <laughs> <laughs> could have just, ha, huh, we booked two flights, a flight to Dubai and a flight to Switzerland. Like, but, but he was, wasn't we he apprehended the, at the uh, airport? We can say and, no, that the, around the, the, area. The, the visual looks bad. Mm -hmm. The aesthetics yeah. look bad. Mm -hmm. However, mm -hmm. if I'm his attorney, mm -hmm. I'm going to point out the fact that if this was a plot to kill someone, my client would have been out of the country before it happened. No, no, no. It, Maybe apparently. weeks and weeks before it happened, and he would have stayed. Did he have any shows out there in Cali? It don't matter. You, you know you, what I'm saying? He could, if he had, you got to think I'm, about I'm that too. No, you, he was in Cali when it, when the shooting happened. No, I'm, I'm telling you what I, I'm telling they you. They he, he was. He was. He, he, he was. Took he took a, a private jet. He yeah. took a private yeah. jet the next day. From Miami. I'm right? telling you what I do to Chicago. He took a private jet too, they're saying. Yeah, I'm, I'm telling you what I do to create reasonable doubt. I'm yeah. telling you why all this stuff looks worse right. than it is. You can right. paint the picture that he was running, or you can paint the picture that I was traveling. I right. didn't know anything about this. I was I was traveling. That's why I say, if you know, what if he had a show? You know what I'm saying? What if he had something going on, business? I that, hope okay. he's innocent. You know, I hope. He, how about that? Yeah. I hope he's innocent. I, I hope he didn't do. I ain't gonna lie, free Dirk, but this is also the quick. It's the quickest yeah. I've ever seen him take a key away from somebody. Like literally, I feel like it happened the next and day. They, they did that to Diddy. Oh, it's a trend now. Yeah, like, they didn't even. They did that to Diddy. Crazy. They, that's the quickest. They and then took that key. and to drop his organization. That's something his, that's, that he you has. You don't want to have your name attached to something like that, no matter who it is. At the end of the day, if somebody yeah. getting called for murder, for hire, you know all this. You gotta rescind that. Yeah. But yeah. I know. But I'm just saying that was just quick. To do for your own image. I I feel you on that, but I do think. Would, you know, politicians are getting a little loose with handing out these keys yeah. to people Some without. Rappers. Hey, no, you no, 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 no. This they is what it is. They be bringing money to these, yeah. to these yeah. states yeah. and all that. No, these this is what it is. Money when the politicians states. give keys to the city, it's for them to try to reach that voter demographic. It's all a political right. game right. for them. That's all. It is. That's all it is. Mm -hmm. it ain't well, got... they need to do better research. They don't care. No, they want to get. They want to reach those people. Understand. Along with that, they disassociated themselves from his youth program. Yeah. Mm. Now that's Quick. foul. Immediately. Quick. Yeah. Immediately. That's foul. That that's foul. And he just changed his life around, right? I hope. He is hoping. He I just wish. listen. He converted. He to just his got mom. off. Yeah. He just got off the of papers mm. after being on there forever. Right. Mm. So he you know just the timing of everything is just really bad. Yeah. He and changes. That's why. I, that's why I'm hoping. He's innocent. Free like, dirt, man. Free dirt. Free dirt. I hope he didn't, dirt. Dirt. Dirt, I hope he didn't do any of this shit. Oh. Get off like Snoop <coughs> oh. I, I, I hope that we give these yeah, young men stuff. a chance to change their lives and a, a chance to get get away from the, the poison and have a better effect on the community. Mm -hmm. Like we, we get told, I get told, I don't press rappers when they come here. Yeah? Yeah, I get told. <laughs> I'll be doing all the I beg to differ. Mech be pressing them. Mech be pressing them. There's, nah, there's, a, there's a difference. Um, these these are, I don't see these kids as the enemy. 
Sorry. I don't look at them as the enemy. I know they doing terrible stuff in the community. Right. I get that. What? What? Uh, who? Talking Ain't about, no kids. We're talking, about, we're talking about drill rappers. Yeah, I, I don't we know had, nobody had, did any terrible things in the community. <laughs> <laughs> They've been on the show, I'm just saying. I don't know. Even, you know even, what I mean? No, nah, I'm being serious. Even the message that they spread, is, it, I, I understand that. I right. get that. But you can't, you can't expect me to approach them the same way I approach somebody from outside the community because these kids are the community. Right. These are our little brothers, little nephews, little... You know what I'm saying? Right. Your little man's in them. They misguided. They doing foul shit. They right. doing the wrong shit. But we can't throw them away. You can't attack them. Attack them ain't gonna do nothing. Yeah. Getting at their necks and penalizing them, pointing the finger, they ain't gonna do shit to them. You, that's not what's gonna help. Right. Trying to get them back, hoping that they going hoping that the ones who are like the the mascot for these kids, the five year old foreigners, the Dirks, hoping that they change their lives in front of everybody. Mm. Hey, look. This is what's cool now. 21 Savage talking about having a chef and having a financial advisor and getting advice from Jay-Z. Let his fans see that happening. Right. And let that be the wave. Right. As opposed to, yo, y'all tearing up the... Y'all, yeah, you stop that fucked up message you do. We saw that already. See, Dolores Tucker tried that. Mm -hmm. it, it didn't work. Calvin Butts tried that. It didn't work. You can't do this and expect it to work. Yeah. Let me say this about the case. I have to ask y'all this. I got another question. I got another question. Do you think the feds will use in the case the stuff that we see online where you have, what, whether it be streamers, YouTubers, or other artists? There it is. They're doing it. You see they're doing that to Young Thug. In, in the indictment, it says. Right. In the indictment. Are you saying they're going to use academic shit? I mean, no, they, they, was, they, I, they I are. think it was more than, more than no, him, they, but they, I know okay. he was they, breaking it they down. They are. In the indictment, yeah. it says open source um, Open source, whatever. So open source means newspapers, yeah, Twitter, whatever, Instagram, whatever. Instagram, whatever the case is. So, so they all of that, that stuff, when when people go online and start breaking down the lyrics, it's and food, right? And all the men of views and clips, they it's use food. And all of that. The sad thing, <clears throat> the sad thing, man. You know, I, I seen something about Lil Durk on the internet before, and it really disturbed me. Like you know how dudes be making fun of how his eyes look. Mm -hmm. Like somebody was breaking that down and said, what that really is, is some shit called a hundred yard stare that, you know, soldiers in war get from seeing so much death, yeah. you know, at, it, it, it shocks you, mm -hmm. shocks your system to a point where you have that crazy stare forever. Ever. Yeah. And, you know, I'm an older dude. Mm -hmm. Little Dirk is a baby to me. You understand what I'm saying? So. When I read that or, or watched that, and I was looking at the way this dude is looking in his, in his face, it's just sad that we grow up, all of us, grow up in these communities where at 15, 16, we done seen 15 niggas get shot and killed in our neighborhoods. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. And that shit just poisons, poisons these kids' minds to, like the bro was saying, eventually it gets to a point where it's like, all right, when does this toxic shit stop? Right. Like, let's keep, like, you know, you got motherfuckers out there, bro. They know record labels, people backing this shit. They know what it is with that drill music shit. Mm -hmm. They know niggas is really right. dying in them streets right. off of these songs. You feel what I'm saying? Right. But it's making money. It's selling shows. You feel what I'm saying? Right. It's, it's, it's bringing in the bacon. You feel me? So they going to keep pushing it. Mm -hmm. And at the end of the day, those... Rappers, those drill rappers, bro, they are expendable to these people. Mm -hmm. They're disposable. Fact. Fact. After Little Dirk, it's going to be another, another nigga one. from Chicago mm -hmm. that's younger than him that, oh, he a shooter, he a slaughter, and they're going to get behind him and push his shit out, and he got about five, six years until he's dead. <laughs> <You heard? laughs> he got about five, six years until he's finished. So right. it's, it's just crazy how we disposable. Old and shot something. His son was 10 years old and shot, shot See, the thing is that these kids are seeing a reward for this antisocial behavior, right. right? They seeing the reward. Oh, if I killed this person, I robbed this person, I'm going to get a record deal, I'm going to make some money, I'm going to get the jury. Straight up, you could blow up Nobody's showing these kids that you could get the jury being legit. Well, apparently, uh, part, the of money the being reward, legit. part of the bounty reward was a record deal. It was a record deal. We're gonna, push you this, we're gonna push you that's in this what, game. Allegedly. Dude, we're gonna push, allegedly. You dudes allegedly. will kill anything to get on in the rap yep. game. That's Damn. a fact. Straight yep. up. But I grew up in a community like that where, you know, you could be cool, you could be fresh, fly, you could get money, but if you wasn't shooting, 
motherfuckers, you wasn't really loved and respected like, like that. that. Right. You know they go to jail. Like, they, they glorify that. Like, oh, you ain't go to jail. Like, that type of shit too. But Dirk been through some shit. You know what I'm saying? They try to rob his crib. You know, a shorty blew out a nigga. You remember that shit? A shorty mm. shot at the nigga. He shot. He been at through too much for his age. Right. Right. For right. his age, my got killed my all of these King Von, all that of these dudes, man, King man like these was traumatized kids, bro. That yeah. ain't that ain't have a a, a a a upbringing with somebody who you know was trying to keep them from getting killed. And Dirk Father was in jail. jail. Yeah, I got a story on my YouTube channel. Father just came home and he going. He just went in. His pops just Which came is home. a trap. That's crazy. Yeah. That's, 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 that's crazy. His father's in court yeah. today? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the pops just came home. It's mm. Just came home. Mm. He going mm. up right in. But it's the cycle. It's, yeah, it's this, cycle this, this perpetual cycle. And we got to find a way to break it. I'm tired of, I'm tired of talking about I feel like the only way you can break it is the well, internet. Well, I, I got to ask right. this question. Serious question. Are the feds breaking it? No. They're doing their job. Their job. Exactly. They're doing their job. But, okay, we're looking at how many rappers now? And there's probably a few more in the way, because I heard way back when Young Thug got indicted that Dirk was next. When have we ever trusted the federal government? <laughs> no, but I'm, I'm, but, uh, but I'm saying- to solve it, all problems. It, mm -hmm. When, when you see enough people famous. go down for this shit, it's a gang does, it, does it make motherfuckers veer off that course? You just told me no. No, I, I don't think so either. No, I don't you think just so. told I don't think me so. no. Because everybody think they bigger than the system. Everybody think that that's them. It's not me. It's not going to happen to me. Oh, they think money is everything. Oh, I was about to say, look, look what comes with it. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? When you act like that, look what everything comes with it. It's Attention. Worth it, it's worth it to them. Money. Right? Attention is the new currency. Every, what? You come home from jail, look how you celebrate. Mm -hmm. Come home from college, nobody knows. That's it. What that's kills me, everybody see this going on and continue to do shit. You see everybody going I to jail. Just you see everybody that. getting killed. Niggas like, oh, I want to try that. I ain't going to No, they just think they bigger than the program. I, they I, think I, they going to get caught. I, I want to say this. There is an addiction. That's It's not pills. It's not, you know, whatever, whatever you put in your system. It's violence. It's violence. There's something that that, that makes you feel protected. When you grow up in these neighborhoods and you learn how to handle yourself, whether it be through violence or people around you willing to inflict violence on other people, there is a, a, a stability. It's a sixth stability that comes from that. There is a, 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 a reverence when somebody knows you get busy. You dig what I'm saying? That's that's American culture. We we could look at it from the street Overall, level, mm -hmm. and we could look at it in wars. Yeah, it's American Ma military, Overall. right? Who don't love John Wick? <laughs> Westerns. Right. Westerns. But how, how many families is probably <laughs> crying because of John Wick? You know, how many funerals happen that's because it's one individual? But we love John Wick. This nigga might have Bow, nigga had six kids. <laughs> he out of here. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> nigga was just, you know, he was with the mob, but he was, you know, getting money for his son's operation. <laughs> he just nigga built his cap crazy. and kept it moving. I'll kill my dog. I'm going to go John no Wick. Word. <laughs> but, it, but this is what I'm saying. Like, it, it, I, I think, think it's the life. It is the life. To, as opposed to the, I think violence is a, is a consequence of the life. Violence is like a symptom of the life, but I think the life is where the addiction is. Outside of the law, the money, the influence, the fame, the, the power. power. Right. I think those the power. I think power is the addiction. The I think power. violence is a consequence of power. I'm violent. I'm violent, but I'm not power seeking, right? right. So you don't see me out here doing things to get power. There are plenty of people who are uh, man, you just waiting the roundhouse somebody, <laughs> nigga. You talk about roundhouse in somebody's face they, soon they get out. They, they coming out the club, some nigga too drunk. He's like, is this the moment? Is this it? That was messed up. That was messed up tonight. Yo, nah, the homie was wild. He was wild. No, but he came was all the way in our section. Karate chop that but, nigga, son. But like, did I touch him? You didn't, but your whole Yo, when your he whole he spilled his liquor, you look, you was like, did I touch him? Wanna know why? Cause you got discipline, but and, that's and discipline. No, that like was like that nigga step on me one more time. <laughs> no, no, and when he did, 
what I did was move to the other. I got no, out you of didn't. Way. And I said, Meg, do you want to sit right here on this side? <laughs> I said, do you want to? Oh, nah, nah, yeah, yeah. Nah, I said, nah, Meg, nah. yo, I, I seen it in your face. I was like, Meg, do you want to sit right here? He was like, nah, I'm good. I'm good right you here. Be good though. You ain't want to. <laughs> I ain't say that. I ain't say that. I ain't say that. I ain't say he ain't gonna be good. I ain't say that. You said if he step on me, I don't know. He might be. He might. Yo, like that sounds like Friday, Meg. Yo, man. No, no, I'm going to get you know, on this bullshit. I was on the phone with Mick um, last week. We oh, having a casual oh, conversation. <laughs> In the middle of the conversation, I'm like, yeah. Mick be capping. Know. He'll fuck somebody up fast. <laughs> and I seen that. I was like, oh, Mick will kill him. Yeah, listen, listen, listen. In the middle of the conversation, now, what was we talking about? I was like, yeah, so um, any other any other questions that, that you think might go viral? He was like, yeah, there was a. Yo, yo, my man, get the fuck away from me right now. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> I was like, yo, what the it's fuck like is Tourette's. I was like, yo, what happened, man? This nigga is crazy. He's like, nah, this crazy. nigga bugging out, man. He bugging out. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll be thinking, yo, if we could nah, just we get this. Nah, we you, man. Yeah. <laughs> he put his phone right here to take a picture. I wasn't look. I'm walk, talking to him, looking this way, mm -hmm. like fishing in my pocket. When I look up, a phone hits me in my glasses. Wow. Oh, Polish. And I just, oh, I, I. I you know, what the fuck was that? And it's a phone. And I can't see shit. It's it's literally like this. And it I feel a clink on my glasses and I snap. Oh no. Nah. My man, the yo, fuck my... away from me. What the fuck are you, you doing? Said, you should have said, yo, son, yo, son, get out of my face, son. <laughs> <laughs> Pass. 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 See how that movie is. <laughs> and then it's not a bad end. Like, no. the, the overall point is, I'm, I'm get out my face. Son. There's a there's a discipline that comes with being anything. There's a discipline that comes with being a rapper. There's a discipline that comes with being a journalist. There's a discipline that comes with being a garbage man. There's a discipline that comes with being an accountant. Everything in life takes discipline. Mm -hmm. But if you don't have OGs around to say, young man, this is what this comes with. We talk about it all the time in here when we talk about rappers. Every time we get into, I'm, I'm constantly saying, this is what it comes with. You don't get to be successful and then have these other things just wiped off. No, you have to learn to deal with all the things that success and fame come But we can't act like all the OGs is only speaking positivity. I'm There's not OGs talking, I out can't, there. I can't talk about, because those aren't real OGs. If you if you leading them the wrong way, you're right. not a real OG, right. you're just old. Right. right. You're just old. And you, you're not you're not doing it right. The title every OG I've ever had told me the right thing to do, even when I was doing the wrong thing. You see, the, the, he that, told me the right way to do the wrong thing. That, that's mm. a, it's a difference to me because if you live in a, a path of crime, the positive OG is not your OG. The no, dude, the dude, again, who, the dude who did thirty years. The right so way no. to do the wrong thing, even that, even that, even what he just said was an OG was an OG quote. Uh, and I'm, I'm not advocating for criminal life, but if you go, listen, if you're going to be out here, yo, yo my man, you going to slide. You can't get three, four people with you, bro. You got to do that by yourself. What's wrong with you? One right. of these niggas is going to turn you. And they're going to be on, like, man. mind your right, fucking right. business. This is going to fuck down right now, nigga. <laughs> 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 that, 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 that's that, exactly that, how they be. That's exactly how they be. That's real. Get the fuck out of here, OG. That's exactly how they be. I tried to stop, stop a couple young boys. And it made me made me want to hurt him. So I said, you mm -hmm. know, I'm not gonna do this mm -hmm. no more. They tell you to mind your business. I mean, as long as you make the conscious effort to do the right thing. Sometimes that could get you in drama yeah, every time. Yeah. Yeah. Trying to that's help you to that, you that, that gets you in shit. Yeah, yeah that should get you in drama with the mind young your business. It ain't easy. It ain't easy. And OG. you're not gonna save everybody. Everybody ain't gonna everybody ain't gonna make it. Just right. know that from the from the door. Everybody ain't gonna make it. Some of these dudes, you mm -hmm. can't do anything about that. You, not Thanks. everybody's going to see the finish line. However, you're supposed to try. Mm -hmm. There's going to be a few of them that listen, though. Exactly. You know what I mean? I remember like, getting... I, I stopped a I lot of little niggas for doing shit. Pulled out the card. Nah, you're not doing that. I remember getting stopped before I they went trade haywire. You? They trade you? And, and, nah, <laughs> yo, come here. Don't do that. Get out the car. Don't do nah. it. Nah, nah, come here, come here, come nah, here, come here, come here. Not now. Not now. Pull over, though. Yeah. Pull over, pull over how about, how about nah. no, let me out, though. Let, let me out, me out. Let me How out. about you not getting in the car? How about, like, no, we know what you're going to do. Nah, you can't. 
Not now, Meg. Not now. Chill, 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 chill. Yeah. Not now. Not here. Not but I now. learned some of their mind already be set. Once their mind is set, nobody is, can which stop is them. When, which is why I say you're not going to save every. Everybody ain't going to make it. Mm -hmm. But you're supposed to. Hell yeah. That shit get exhausting, man. I, I, I done saved a whole bunch of motherfuckers that I know they was headed to the penitentiary. Mm -hmm. You feel me? But after a while, you do get exhausted saving motherfuckers. You be like, yeah. damn, bro. Like, I'm tired of talking to these little niggas. Like, you feel mm -hmm. me? And it's been a couple of dudes that I didn't say shit to, and I regretted that later on. In yeah, life. I predicted yeah, I some niggas get killed nigga. too. I was I like, he gonna him. die before the summer's over. They gonna kill that little nigga right there. Yep. This niggas just doing too much. Well, my rap me. group, I got, I had a rap group called named Potter's Field. It was me and a bunch of motherfuckers younger than me that was on their way to the pen or dead or or the grave. Mm. That I, I I put a monkey wrench in that shit. None of them niggas never went to the can. None of the, all of them is alive. Mm -hmm. But all of them was going. Mm -hmm. They was going. You feel me? Salute, salute. And salute. you know, I was a dude that just came home from the pen. I had just came home from the pen for doing time. I wasn't that much older, but I was 22, 23 when they was 16, 17. Mm -hmm. And they was reckless. You feel what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. One time I came out the building, dudes was trying to rob the Chinese dude, right? At gunpoint or whatever they was doing. And I said, yo, I, I tweaked on dudes so crazily. I said, man, you want to go up north for eight years for $20 from the Chinese man and some fucking beef fried rice? You feel me? I said, nigga, that's an armed robbery. Mm -hmm. And I explained it to mm -hmm. these dudes. When you mm -hmm. young, you, you sometimes a young dude, they just ain't got an older dude to explain it to them. Yo, that's eight years. You could catch an A felony. They could try to give you a dub for that. And you might cop out to eight after laying up on the island for two years. After you get in these niggas' heads like that, and then they start seeing dudes in the hood that get nabbed up and go up top right. for 10, they start realizing, you right. feel me? And a lot of the, some of these young dudes would just be like, they ain't no suckers. They still street dudes. They still, a, if they have to, they'll still blow their shit. But, <laughs> you feel me? But, <laughs> niggas ain't wreck, dudes ain't reckless like that when you broad daylight doing crazy stuff. That could send you to the pen. You, we all had them stages in our That's lives, but an older That's dude got to pull you to the but side. But now, what happens like, when those kids think that jail is a right to passes for them? Like they need that a part of their life because there's yeah. a lot of kids that or, think that. Or jail, not even no, no, that. But, like but, the you, Chinese, but you do know, the like, a Chinese man. I mean, I mean, we was hungry. Yeah, you know, and they were. What you was? Oh, tell she us. Yeah, we, Kim. Oh, she got a story to tell. Kim, what's up? I mean, this is like the '80s. Does this it make like a difference? Does that make a difference? It's my get out. It's my get out of get out of jail free card. <laughs> Tell me more, kid. What's the statute of limitations on that? This is the eighties. Seven joints. That I, don't was, know, this I don't know what you did. This is the eighties. The eighties. That was a common thing in my neighborhood. Uh, yeah. You yeah. wanted a food. The, um, they bring the food. Because you want to know what the true crime. Want to know what the true the crime food. is? Poverty is the true crime, and nobody addresses that. Yeah. In right. All, in all stages. And we wanted four chicken wings and fried rice. Yeah. But see what happened now. You can't even. You, you feel me? They not pulling that's up no more. They don't come in the building. Oh, you gotta meet them outside. I'm, I'm the, crazy. I'm yeah, the you don't only want to do that. that niggas is doing real crime. Seven, seven, seven years. years. I mean, what you say? From the Chinese, get Chinese food. Really? That's not. That's not a Brooklyn thing. That was a Castle Hill thing. No, that was a Brooklyn thing. We was we was taking Domino's pizza. He's killing you. He's killing you, Spin. You can't even get it. Speaking of speaking of OG school and the youth. This picture has been circulating recently. Young Thug and Lil Durk. And apparently it's Young Thug showing Lil Durk how to cause a mistrial. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> he gonna need him a Lil Woody. <laughs> Yikes. Uh, now. Yo, what are the odds though? That's crazy. That's after, after, that's because charge your phone, bro. That shit is crazy. That dead in five seconds. After hearing all this shit, all this shit comes to light, <clears throat> what happens to the music? It's all about money. If he beat the case, he gonna be the biggest. I can tell you one thing. Uh, Federal Nightmares, that one song is probably like doing not like us numbers right now. I was on Apple Music earlier. All certain, it's different songs than it, it was other Yeah, music. and it just get, yeah. And all of those are just hot now. All of those are hot now. <laughs> So what happens when I'm learning sign language? Yeah, bro. right. What happens when shit like this equals more money for the record label? Yeah, they go look for the next artist to commit the same type of crime. 
so they can profit off of it. That's all it is, bro. We and we the only genre of music where we disrespect our women. We talk about killing each other, slotting on our ops. We're not the only genre. What other genre? No, we're the most popular. Middle Eastern music. <clears throat> oh, come on, bro. I'm just saying. <laughs> come on, they do bro. That. They do that. Just, they, they do that. We're come the most, on, bro. We're don't the most watch popular. the videos. We're the most popular. Oh, right. She got money for us. We, <laughs> and we have the, we have the most to lose. <laughs> yeah. We have we have the most to lose. They, they've been taking advantage. They, these labels will take advantage of every <laughs> fucked up situation that we have. That's a fact. So I don't, I don't understand. Again, we right back around the other side of the coin again. This is not new. This is not a hot take. It's not new. Everybody knows this already. Mm. You know the labels are exploiting. You know, you know they're ready for you to do some fucked up shit. You know they take advantage of your, your impoverished situations and your desperation. We Everybody know. Everybody says that. That's it. Didn't Jay and Meek put something together for them not to be able to use your um your lyrics against That's you? That's in New York. They trying to change that law. Yeah, that that and, law applies. It, I, it, it's I, in New York. It's only in New York? As, as far as they I They trying know, to create a federal one, federal one, too. But the thing is, is that music is art at the end of the day. <laughs> music is art at the end of the day. I, I, I want to say shout out to the rapper who made sure that that bass was covered. Shout out to him. Oh. Shout out to him. I just want to say that. You know what I mean? I mean, what's the name in, in, uh, in uh, Atlanta said, if what was that famous quote she said? If you say it in your rhyme, I'm going to use it against oh, you. Uh, the one oh, Trump yeah. got yeah. Um, had Not the fa- issue with Fanny Trump. Willis. Fanny, yeah. Fanny Willis, yeah. She said it. Oh, well. Because they're not. <laughs> prosecutors ain't artists, bro. They're here to do their job. Your job is to say what you say. Their job is to get convictions. Of criminals, yeah. Art imitates crime. life, imitates. And art. then in our culture, we are taught that whatever we rap about, we gotta be about. Right. So when you hear these yeah. artists talk about, I shot this, I did that. Right. Da is like, yeah, keep talking. Oh yeah, yeah. oh yeah, keep talking. But keep it real. The Mom problem Trump. is we love the destruction. The problem is our people have an appetite for destruction. So when anybody cooks up a recipe for disaster, we front row center with our, with our plates, I, I, spoons, and forks. I think we have a more of an appetite for authenticity. Nah, I, I think nah, no, 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 nah. no. Because in this culture, whether it's a song about the feds is on your back, and then uh, an indictment comes down, or it's your girlfriend wilding in public, and Kanye makes a song about it, we love the authenticity. Those are all negative examples you just gave. All right. Um, D1 is out here being wild authentic. All he gets is backlash. And he's being authentic as shit. Well, the art usually is supposed to imitate life. And then what happens is the people that are listening to it, they start getting intrigued and their lives start imitating the art. But mm-hmm. That's what Kim said. Art imitates life, imitates art. It's just, well, it's a cycle. Seagull just However, D1. How, it's, not, it's, not, it's not authenticity when somebody's being authentic and they get hate for being authentic. Mm-hmm. D1's authentic as shit. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, he Aries. Are going ag- word. Are going, going Aries going against guy. everybody's green. <laughs> yep. Uh, yeah, he's like the he's and like he the Christian battle rapper. He yeah. gil- he still gets that. Yeah. He's, he's like the Christian battle rapper. He's battling all other yeah, rappers. You, you think of rap, you think of hip hop, you don't think of that. That's just why. Again, eh, and because, I'm, because we have I'm just an saying. appetite for destruction, bro. D- but D1 mm-hmm. has a lot of content that's based on content that's already out. You get what I'm saying? No, I don't. All right. If if I didn't have a rapper to diss, then and I wouldn't be there wouldn't be no battle rappers. If I couldn't diss nobody, but if I could look around and be like, oh, this is what y'all motherfuckers doing, I got shit to talk about. You think so that's what co- no, I commend D1 for speaking up and giving his opinion on it and being fearless. Fearless. Remember we <laughs> we did the interview and in Harlem, I was like, yo, you not nervous, nigga? You know, He's Aries, bro. Yeah, that's what it is. You know what I mean? But I feel like that category of music, the critique music, I don't know. It has in the it doesn't have the same appeal. I don't because as someone talking about their actual life. That he is talking about his actual he life. He is talking though. about his actual life. And that's life. the other part of it. He he hasn't always been on this way but he's always been making this level of music mm-hmm. like he hasn't always been shouting people out but it wasn't until somebody said something about him he was like, oh word yeah okay no. cool we can play <laughs> right but i don't know if you want to come outside once we start because i can point the finger all day and all the shit you've been doing and all the shit y'all been and he does, he's not just on rappers right he's on the culture as a whole back to what spin said the music industry is 
feasting off of our worst traits, off of our, our, mm-hmm. our dysfunction. Mm-hmm. So, so is Hollywood. Everybody does. Yeah. Our dysfunction, our personal dysfunction. Why, why is it such a strong market? Appetite for destruction. Yeah. Two people dapping each other. If me and you was walking down the block, I saw you dap you, said something cool, walked off, nobody would care. Me and you walking down the block, and go, oh, what's up now, nigga? Phones out. It's, it's alarming. Everywhere. It's alarming. And, we and it's louder. And it don't have to be. If we walked up like, what's up, my nigga? Yeah, I love you, nigga. I ain't nope. seen you. We still get some no attention. Phones, no look. phones will come out. <laughs> it's just not the same. No, no phones will come out. Nobody will want to record that and show their friends later. <laughs> no phones will come out. Somebody, somebody would. Somebody, somebody got it. Look, look at me. Me. These niggas look is weird. Look at Mac and love. <laughs> But it goes back to what you said about just <laughs> the general public thirst for attention and fame. Because when people pull out those phones, they thinking, I'm going to go viral for this. Let That's me film what I was, was going to say, I'm gonna the go viral, viral thing. This. That's all it's about. Look at what happened with Daniel Penny and him choking out the, the Michael Jackson performer on the train. Choke this guy out. Oh, yeah. Nobody stopped yeah. him. Everybody recording. Like, yep. what are we doing here? Yeah. Yep. What we always do. A lot of us don't want to deal with the fact, and myself included, that we just didn't get a lot of attention as kids. So sometimes we seek it other places. Yeah. We never want to deal with that conversation. And look wow. at the numbers that on that hashtag that's viral. Yeah. When we put it viral, look at the numbers. The where my mother took me or dropped me off so she could have other things to do. I make sure I sent her. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And these are the, these are the people that's, in the comment section that you're real. taking advice from. I never heard that. Well, I was left critique, alone a lot as a critique kid. Critique rap. What? Critique rap. I'm gonna use yeah. that. I never heard that term yeah. before. It's been around since the oh. 90s. I never heard it. It must be a battle rap thing. Do you know about <laughs> it? <laughs> critique rap? You know, yeah. Yeah. It's been around. <laughs> Stop. Y'all heard about critique rap? No. You never heard that. Did you coin that? That's a no. whole fact. Ooh, but that's a whole it's been, situation. come on. Man. I you never heard it. someone. Imaginary player was a critique rap song. Okay. It was, but I'm, I never heard that critique rap term. I mean, I haven't been writing for a while, but uh, me that was good, Matt. In the case of, of what's going on with Dirk, um, it's kind of tough because if I say, keep your head up for free Dirk. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, bro. <laughs> You know, there's people. There, there, there's some people that be, would be bothered by that. So, as usual, I'm gonna say innocent to proven guilty. Let's just see what happens. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm so special, I'm so special, I'm so special, so special, so special. I'm like Ichigo, master in a red suit. This my bank I form, I'm about to let loose. Better make your next move your best move. Straight out the gate, niggas gonna hate and try to test you. Watch who you with, who your man's, who you next to. If you take a hit with son assist like a nephew. You can never check us, homie, this a chess move. Wrote this on the little short bus, I'm so special. If man say get him, I'ma get him, ain't no talking when I pull up. Park up. Hop out, run down with my hood up. Now what the fuck are you hating for? Can't DFG get money anymore?